Hey Magic Community on YouTube, T1 Glistener Elf here. Back with some more Vintage, I'm still in the Unto Untap Open League, this is round 3, and I'm playing Blazing Infect. This is, I've given this uh, every deck video, but let, just in case this is your first one for the Vintage League, let me just explain really quickly how this works. You play an Infect creature, so Blighted Agent or Ink Moth Nexus, and then you pump it up with Blazing Shoal, pitching either Progenitus, uh, which is this one, so plus 10 plus 0, and I guess I should point out what, uh, I should show what Blazing Shoal is. And if you need to, pause in 1080p to read these cards. Uh, or, Blasphemous Act. Blasphemous Act is there because we can go and get it with a Mystical Tutor. And that's basically the main game plan of the deck. The, the alternate backup, uh, the backup win cons are, we have Blightsteel, Tinker, or we have Show and Tell, which can get Blightsteel or Progenitus. Uh, either one. My opponent is, this should look a little bit familiar, <laughs> it's like we played this last week. Uh, this is Hogak Vine, uh, albeit a little bit different. You, you'll notice a few uh, distinctions with the- wait, no you don't! No you don't! This is the same list, isn't it? <laughs> or at least this part looks the same. I'm not gonna go and check right now to see if it's exactly the same list. Uh, by the way, if you didn't know, happen to know that I live in Georgia, you can use the ads here. <laughs> Yes, I, I live in Georgia. Uh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, um, so it looks like, uh, Green Sky's on the play. Green Sky Dragon. Mox Emeralds. Uh, Dismember. Blasphemous Act. I mean, so we have a Tutor and a Preordain, so even though we lack a Creature and Blazing Shoal, I think we'll get there. I will say... Keep. Nice... Miku, by the way. You know, as you do. Alright. Yeah. Alright. Uh, so, by the way, that's a, that's a keep from both of us, then. Thanks. It's my I wrote like that as well. Sweet. Uh, yep, so we are... We have drawn two. And we are discarding... Uh, Cabal, Double Cabal Therapy, and a Hogak. Quite the haul already. That's not, that's not great. Uh, we better hurry, I suppose. Uh, let's draw. Oh, okay, so we found a piece. We found Ink Moth Nexus. Uh, let's go. This is an Emerald. No one deflects the Emerald Splash. Okay. So, I would like to be able to go and get... and play Ink Moth Nexus here, and try to go for the kill next turn. If we play Ink Moth, we can go on the next turn Polluted Delta. And actually, let me take a look at my opponent. Four ways then, okay. We can go Polluted Delta, uh, Preordain, find the combo, and then win immediately. Maybe that's a little hasty, but I think that this might be what I'm supposed to do. And for Cabal Therapy, we actually can use Force of Will. Um, even if we don't find it with Preordain, that is Imperial Seal, so it is at sorcery speed. So I do have to be careful. But, I think that I can make this work. Alright, uh, no, 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 they're slow enough, they're slow enough. We'll, we'll have a turn. We'll, we'll have a little bit of time. All right, so let's take a look, find card, and by the way, it will be, oops, yeah, yeah, we're, we're I, I should have declared what I was doing first so that I could search twice through my deck really quickly. I could, I could do this uh, in one motion, uh, but it's okay. So if I play the island, then I don't have to worry about Wasteland. So I think that I should play the island, despite it not letting me hold up the Imperial Seal. I think that that's probably where I'm supposed to be. Okay. And then shuffle. Blip. Alright, now this does mean that Force of Will is down. So one weakness to what I just did is that uh, Force of Will is down. Uh, let me check the hotkey again, just to make sure. Uh, look at, let's see, 
What was look at again? Hmm. I, I want to make sure I don't mess this bit up. Maybe it was over here? Are there other hotkeys that I just don't remember? Send card. Uh, I remember that there is something I could do. Uh. What's the hotkey for look at again? I am blind, apparently, right? Hmm. Let's see. Oh, no, no, it's G. It's G. They renamed it Pete. 2G. Alright, cool. Yeah, I am, I am blind. It was, it's look at, right there. Uh, no, no, not there. 2G. Cool, I didn't find either one. That's not great. Okay, so I can play it safe here by... Ink Moth definitely goes on the bottom, for sure. Send to deck bottom, and I can let this be my draw, just in case they happen to have strip mine. It also would give me access to Imperial Seal, so I would definitely have that going for me. Um, but I don't know that that's right. I, hmm, yeah, I think that that's probably the safer, it's definitely the safer thing to do, to go for Underground Sea. It's slow though. We're not we're not winning if we do that, right? Against this deck, they already have Hogak in the yard with double Cabal therapy. So send to deck bottom and draw. Ah, blighted it. Four twenty Blagent. Good, good, good. Right on time, man. And we have a blue card again, and we'll pass. Not not ideal, but we'll make it work. Alright, perfect. They started off with their bazaar. This may be a little janky, but I'm I'm kind of scared of a, a list that has four wastelands on the play. On the draw, it's less good because they have to just time walk themselves. Uh, okay, there was wasteland. So the fact that they discarded it means they don't think that they're worried about it, right? If I hadn't, though, they could have kept the wasteland and then punished me. Okay. Uh, alert response. Oh. Hello? Okay, cool. Huh, what do we want to do? They haven't played a land yet, so if they do play a land, they get blood gas back, and then they can fire off the Hogak. Uh... Force Pitch Blighted Agent. Alright. Okay, so they, they don't have even a creature. I mean, they, they'll have a creature. There we go. So there's Bloodgast. Yup. <laughs> That's the response. That's the appropriate response. Yup. Alright, and they dropped uh, Wasteland, so hopefully we'll get there. Oh, they sacked it. What are they naming? Uh, resolves. So, if you ask what are you naming with uh, Cabal Therapy, what you're effectively saying is it resolves, uh, because naming it is not part of the cost. <laughs> no worries, it's a wild list. Uh, if they actually get the right answer here, good on them, because exactly none of these, well, are ideal for what I'm trying to do. Dismember is a removal spell, but they don't care. Blasphemous Act is, all right, the worst one. <laughs> all right, let's reveal. Alas. Not that they care too much. They'll get another shot at it in just a sec. Because they can crack this fetch land and do it again. Gee, I wonder what they're getting. Actually, I do wonder what they're getting. Because 
They could take Imperial Seal, but I don't have black mana for it. I wouldn't have had black mana, though, if they had the, uh, if I had played that out, if I had played Underground Sea, uh, because of Wasteland. Alright. Now. Yup. In retrospect, the correct play probably, probably, would have been get Underground Sea, Imperial Seal, get Wastelanded, and that gets rid of the Wasteland for an Ink Moth Nexus. Uh, yep. No response. I mean, I can't respond anyway, but, you know. I mean, I can. I can fire off Dismember. That seems like a bad idea. Oh, crap. Should have responded to the trigger. Oops! Not like that's on camera or anything. Alright. There we go. That's a lot easier to type. Alright, well, we're not dead yet. Pretty close, though. Okay. Yeah, okay, that's that's on me. That's a hundred million percent on me. <sighs> oh, boy. Oh, boy! Well... I uh, could still win off of a top deck. It's like, oh, now he has a window. Not if I suck. Alright. So, wait a minute. I'm going to take 11 here. You win anyway, but there's that. You might have had it regardless. Two turn clock had I hit it properly. Well, now I <laughs> better not forget that. This member is not, as it turns out, completely dead in the matchup. <laughs> Game two? I don't know if they're actually typing something out now. I wouldn't be surprised. Alright. Uh. Open sideboard. Alright, well, we really need to make something happen. And we can, but holy crap. Alright, main board. There's Raven's Trap in the Cages. Two, three, four, five. We just sideboard the same way that we did last time, I suppose. Raven's Trap. We take out... Let's see. Work our way up. Uh, pre or, or not Preordain. We could do some number of Preordain, but 
I think Force of Will is what I'm taking out here. Force of Will, uh, we could keep in Mental Misstep. Let's, let's take a look. What does Mental Misstep hit again? In the sideboard, we have uh, Deafening Silence, but that's not... Eh, it's not great against us. Uh, Cabal Therapy, its own, the own Mental Misstep itself, though the combo itself is uh, protected against Mental Misstep. Uh, we have Citrus Supplier, Basking Root Walla. Yeah, I mean, it's something. It's not great, but it's something. At least. So, let's go through here first. M Imperial Seal almost certainly gets the cut. Uh, Hercules Recall gets the cut. All of the Force of Wills. And then let me make sure I don't have anything like Flusterstorm or Spell Pierce in here. That doesn't do... You know, despite having the chance to save me that game, I Dismember is not good enough. So with that, we can put Imperial Seal back in. Yeah. Okay. We're, we're good. We're set to go. Alright, so... 7C. After the match, may you please tell me how you sideboarded. Alright, this is, uh, everything we need. Actual, factual, everything we need. The only thing that can get us here would be Wasteland or Strip Mine. Other than that, we're good. And they're not going to start off with a turn one Wasteland, right? They're going to start off with a turn one Bayou. Bayou. Jeez, Bazaar of Baghdad. Another B-A land. Bayou. Oh my goodness. Wake up, Jay. <sighs> okay. Is this Pearl? Pass. Okay. I'm going to make you do it. If you play out the Bazaar turn one, you lose. In fact, we can even check just to make sure they don't have any dismember shenanigans. Chalice would be neat. Chalice would also not work. Mindbreak Trap, no, that won't work. Do I have it? Do you think that I have it? That is the question. Oh, Jay, don't beat yourself up about Dismember for forever. You can still win this, especially if game two is going your way. Plus, we're playing the deck with the ridiculous amounts of hate. They could actually beat me with Force of Vigor. That's a, that's a card. Uh, it's a four of in the main board. Okay, so that's actually a thing I need to worry about. That's a problem. So yeah, regardless, we're going to fire off the Preordain first, as, of course, we're supposed to. Because I took out all the Force of Wills, yeah, Force of Wills, I won't be able to stop it. But Force of Will on the play is not... Force of Will in this matchup is not great. Ah, okay. Well, that happens. Uh, yep. See? It's gone. Alright, they did indeed fire off Wasteland. Okay. Yeah, we just kind of had a mutual agreement there. Uh, anything else? Second. And... Mox. Pass. Alright, well, so much for the free win in game two. That, that caution was merited. This is not being streamed. That's, that's not like a stream sniping or anything. I said... <laughs> Alright, watch them have another. Oh, uh... 
What if I said... Let's try this again. Fire. Uh, let's not pass. That would have been bad. Find card. Um, there aren't that many black cards I care about now. Demonic Consultation, Demonic Tutor, Imperial Seal. That's it. We've already burned through two wastelands. What are the freaking odds? It's a very technical term. Although that makes me think that they don't have Force of Vigor. Alright, so it's 2G. Ah. Uh, nope. And... Nope. Oh, okay. I mean, I guess I can live with that. That's a little slow, but we'll take it. It's a good thing that we fetched the underground sea then. Okay, there it is. Um, so what do we go and get with Imperial Seal? I guess we could just go and get another Ink Moth Nexus. So Imperial Seal puts Ink Moth... Oh, this is really slow. Imperial Seal is sorcery speed. All right. Oops. Let's uh, make sure to do that. Alright, make sure that that resolves. No, let's get Blighted Agent! That's right, we should definitely get Blighted Agent here. Because Force of Vigor can't... Uh, well, wait a minute, let's take a look. Actually, first, let me make sure I hit this. Alright, good. Um... Yeah, they don't have anything to kill creatures other than Wasteland, Strip Mine, and Force of Vigor. So I guess we just go for the slow but steady route, don't we? Uh, let's find a card. Let's go find our good friend Blagent. Hello? Hello? There we go. Send to deck top. Okay. And there we go. And pass turn. Alright, so they drew. Okay. Let's see what they do. Uh, what is this? This is a... Uh, there is a blood gas, so in response to the landfall trigger, we will use the ravenous trap. Oi. The deck's fine. The deck is fire. But, uh, piloting error. Good times. Can't have that. Okay. I mean... Seems pretty good. Alright, wait a sec. Let's take a look. Hogak, Force of Vigor, and Bayou. Uh... Hmm. All right, stitch your supplier, go. Ooh, death right shaman. Play another creature though, and then we're going to have issues. What you got? What do you have? Ugh. 
Um, yeah, that's a thing. Boop! Uh, in case it matters. Boop! There we go. There we go. Okay, so now this blighted agent's gonna be a little awkward. Just a little bit. If they actually fire off the wasteland here, which they should, yep, there we go. That's a little awkward. Oh, hello? I thought I said, there we go. All right. Yep, kind of knew it. <laughs> Fastest turn ever. I mean, three wastelands. Yeah. And they have a way to draw themselves out of it. I kind of don't. Hmm. I mean, granted, once I get a single more mana, I'll be good. Yep. Alright, there's another blood ghast. Of course there is. No response. All right. Can we, if I get a land here, or a Mox, or a Black Lotus, then we're good to go. Let's see. Did, is that a fourth wasteland? Is that a fourth wasteland? <laughs> ah! <laughs> Did you sacrifice a goat to Richard Garfield? Uh, can we still win? Wait a minute. Also, how much damage did I take? It's kind of hard to tell here because of the... the Hogak casting. I think I took two. Yeah, I, I took two. Right? Because, uh... You could... Oh, no, wait, that's the only one that could attack. So, just Deathrite Shaman. Did it? No, wait, 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 wait. Oh, did, uh, I think they might have eaten a wasteland for mana? What? I have no idea. Beep! Yep, okay, cool. Is it a land? Can we please play a game three? I need you to 3 0 -oh me, please. <laughs> For my, that, that's not being ironic here. That's, I actually do want to get 3 0'd so that I can't blame myself for messing up game one. I need. You got it. Keep existing deck. To lose this so that I don't beat myself up for losing game one. Alright. And I'll cut that and paste it if I, if I feel like it. Oh, geez, wrong one. Oops. <laughs> uh. Wrong command, but that works, I guess. Let me make sure that came out correctly. Has peeped top seven cards, then drew seven cards. It, it's a little roundabout, but it got there. Uh, that said... Well... Right. 
Mulligan to seven. Uh, keep. Send to deck bottom. What did, what did you say? Oh, okay. Oh, keep. All right. Huh. Should I ask them to be on the play this game? You can be on the play. Looks like it's moving in that direction. Ah. Yeah, that happens though. Yeah, so no matter what, it's getting reported as a 2 over green. No matter what. Oh, what is this? Oh, fun. And. Wasteland. Okay. And Rootwalla. Cool. Uh, no response. That sounds good by me. That looks good by me. Yeesh. On that happy note... Alright, well, we can still manage. Maybe. Okay. What you got? Ah. <laughs> Is Wasteland your invitational card? <laughs> it's a stand. It can just be summoned at any point, at any time. Yeah, that that'll do it, I suppose. Target moi. All right, let's see what we can do with this. All right, that was an emerald, so that's all right. I'm assuming that this resolves. It's funny because I tried being a wasteland Delver player, but that hasn't gone very well. In vintage or a legacy? Nah, legacy. Okay, one, two, three. Dear goodness. Okay, well, this is a thing, I suppose. I guess that's where we're at right now. Uh, sure. One. Two. Do we want to just tinker here? I guess. Uh. Blue, blue, blue. There we go. Ahem. Okay. Tinker. Sack, because that's part of the cost. Ready for the <laughs> Iron Giant? Yeah, that's what's about to happen. That's exactly what's about to happen. Blight Steely Boy. With the green. Well, crap. Uh uh, by the way, I had to play the Graph Digger's Cage second so that I could actually get the Blightsteel Colossus. Otherwise, it would actually restrict me from doing so. Because can't enter from libraries. Disrude, <laughs> where were you last turn? <laughs> In the corner being rude. 
Green, green, green. Okay. Ooh. You aren't kidding. So there's that. Uh, this is Hogak time, right? Okay. Oh, that's what the tap was for earlier. It's Death Rite Shaman being tapped for Convoke. Wow. I can spell. I don't know what accents to use, so I'll just say with pleasure. It's uh, in French, avec pesu. Pesu. Uh... Scooch. Rar. Well, <laughs> now I can't <laughs> not beat myself up for that. <laughs> that was one costly dismember miss. GG's. Take them down for me. To be fair, the RNG might not have panned out the same way. Uh, oh! Yeah, yeah, sideboard. Uh, mine was one ravenous trap, one city in a bottle, four G cage, Graph Digger's cage. My outs were... <sighs> outs were... Hercules Recall. I think that that's right, but I'm not sure. Uh, four, Force of Will. And the last one was Dismember. Oofy Chalice, Once Upon a Time, uh, Stitcher Supplier. Okay. Chalice... For me, it works, but not on the combo. I guess you still name... I guess you still name one for the cantrips and tutors. Yeah, and tutors. Except for demonic tutor. Mmm... Yeah, I guess it works. And it, 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 is, it hits mental misstep. Ah. Yeah. If you can get to two, then heck yes. <laughs> that's, a, that's a problem. That's a pain. Carmenova can attest to how strong that is. Uh, he beat me in the quarterfinals with that play. Chalice on two ruined my day. <laughs> Wasn't sure about Blazing Shoal. Needs to account for X to counter. So X equals, or uh, I guess CMC, X on Chalice needs to be equal to uh, 11 or 12. <laughs> yeah! I got a Sanctum Prelate player in a previous league doing that, unfortunately. Uh, but now they know better, so... It works. Duh, I should have... Ah! <laughs> to be fair, Different, oh, I just said this on camera, but different RNG may have given you the win regardless. 
<laughs> All of the mana. I kind of want to misspell that as T-E-H. <laughs> as you do, I suppose. Alright. It's hopefully a mistake I won't make later. <laughs> yeah! Yeah, that was actual... That was crazy. <laughs> that was crazy, dude. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness! Ah, didn't didn't play it properly. Ah. All right. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Oh. Actually, you. Okay, so wait a minute. Wait a minute. If I kill the stitcher supplier, might have had me anyway. I kill stitcher supplier, trigger it then you find another root walla or bloodgast or even vengevine and do it the next turn and would that have actually killed me if that had happened if that had happened See, I had Imperial Seal, which goes and gets a combo piece, and then I win on the next turn. If I use Dismember, it sets them back a turn, maybe? Maybe. Because if I'm killing it in response to the trigger, they're getting six cards. And Hogak is already in there, so they have at least seven cards counting Hogak. So if they hit... Yeah, on the next turn... Let's see, that was on their turn. So then it passes to my turn, Imperial Seal, put it on top. Their turn... Ah, I still might... Never mind. Never mind. Deathrite Shaman grass, gassed and bizarre so I could easily refuel and cast Gak if you stopped me that turn. I mean in game one. Uh... Stitches player and Gast were out. Yeah. Uh, not Deathright Shaman, but Blood Gast was correct. Yeah. Yeah, so that still would have had me. Or you could have drawn. Wait a minute. Yeah, yeah, it would have had to be uh, Force of Vigor. Or a bunch of things. Or cast the second Cabal Therapy. Yeah, I feel <laughs> better <laughs> thinking that I wouldn't have won regardless. Odd to say, but, you know, you know. All right, this, this has gone on for long enough. Probably wouldn't have gone Cabal if Gak failed because Gas is broke up. <laughs> Don't say that! Don't tell me that! Well... Thanks, <laughs> thanks for the games. There we go. Thanks for the GGs. Uh, DM me to jam later. I'm good with that. Thanks. I'll need it. And caffeine. You have failed me for the last time. That's it, I guess. Take care, Magic Community. I'll see you all later. Bye-bye. <laughs>